All right. Uh, first with entertainment in the morning, here's uh, Morgan Hoffman, who joins us uh, once again. Morgan, good to see you. <laughs> and uh, you remember any first day on the job? Uh, oh, you don't street? even know. My first show was a cooking show, and I did not know how to cook. It was a <laughs> disaster. But I think that added to the fun of the this, this show. But, right. yeah, no, I was a disaster my first show. So you were the host, not the, not the no, guest. No, I was a host, yeah, okay. interviewing chefs and people who were in these really <laughs> impressive restaurants. And I was like, how do you crack an egg? Like, <laughs> like actually, it was really embarrassing. But... <laughs> Also, those tapes have been burned. Yeah, okay, good. <laughs> we got to talk about Jack Black. So he's on tour with his band, Tenacious D. He just canceled the rest of his tour after his bandmate, Kyle Gass, made inappropriate comments in regards to Donald Trump's assassination attempt. Uh, Jack posted this to social media. He said, I was blindsided by what was said at the show on Sunday. I would never condone hate speech or encourage political violence in any form. Now, Kyle Gass has since come out and apologized for his remarks. Uh, however, Jack Black just said, nope, that's it. We're canceling the tour because they have received a ton of backlash of these comments. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, meanwhile, uh, Marvel fans, they are buzzing. We've got a new trailer for the uh, Deadpool and uh, Wolverine uh, film. Yes. So, I mean, I'm going to say this is one of the most highly anticipated films of the year, if not, you know, the, the year, the summer. Um, so this is exciting, a new teaser. And here's what everyone is talking about. Lady Deadpool. So once again, we're getting teases of who is going to play Lady Deadpool. In this teaser, you can see the blonde hair, the outfit. A lot of people think it's going to be played by either his wife, Blake Lively, or Taylor Swift. The fans all want mm. Taylor Swift to play this role. Is that because of the connection with uh, Ryan Ryan Reynolds? Yeah, so Ryan Reynolds uh, and Blake Lively are very good friends of Taylor Swift. If mm. you follow them, they're at games together. They go to birthday parties together. They vacation together. I mean, I want to be part of this cool group. Sure. I never will, but I want to be. <laughs> um, so people are really, really hoping this is what it's going to be. We, you know, they've teased that there are going to be so many cameos in this film. So I think a lot of people are just mm -hmm. hoping it's Taylor Swift. I'd love Blake Lively, but I'll take Taylor Swift. Um, <laughs> and it's really exciting. To, I mean, I'm going to throw this out there. I get to actually interview uh, Hugh Jackman and Ryan Reynolds on the red carpet next week when they're here in Toronto. Mm -hmm. Tell Ryan we say hi. I will. <laughs> I will. I will. So that's, that's really exciting. Uh, it is. It is. I can't wait for that. Uh, also, uh, speaking films, Madonna turned to social media to talk about her biopic. Okay. So listen, the fans are getting real excited here because uh, she just posted these new photos of her looking quite lovely in front of a typewriter. And she's basically teasing that she's working away. And this is why fans are so excited because we knew as of last year that this biopic was in the works, that she was going to be directing it. She was co-writing it. Um, we heard about boot camp, that she was putting potential candidates to play her through. Um, we knew last year uh, that Julia Garner was up to play uh, uh, her in a biopic, Florence Pugh, and then it was scrapped. Then we heard, nope, it's not happening, and people were so upset. I mean, I remember being so upset about this. I was like, no! Um, but listen, Madonna wants to make it good. Uh, this is 40 years of success her life she wants to make this good so the fact that she's posting this knowing what kind of effect that would cause yeah for all the fans i think it's in the works okay i, I think this is it. i think it would be so cruel if she teased us and this wasn't happening <laughs> so i'd love to see this happen and, and i personally would love to see julia garner play this role okay kind great cool. to see uh sorry go ahead typewriter yeah Typewriter. Oh, yeah. I, I, old style? <laughs> old style typewriter. I was like, nice. nice That's what I uh, actually pounded my first news script out on, I believe, way back in the day. <laughs> We're going back. I'm Jeff yeah. MacArthur. <laughs> All right, and before we go, we managed to find that footage of Morgan on the cooking show. No! <laughs> <laughs> I had trauma around it. Yeah. I like, what's that? No, like, yeah. some of the questions, like, I think one time I was like, so what does asparagus taste like? Like, who <laughs> <laughs> that. I was trying to be creative. I don't know. All right. First in the morning with entertainment, <laughs> Morgan Hoffman. Morgan, thank you. Thanks, guys. <laughs>